Hi, I'm Tanya from My Vinyl Cut, and I'd like to show you how to mask a heat transfer transfer. So if you order printed transfers, already printed in contour cut like this, um, and you don't know how to get it on your shirt, I'll show you how to do that. So um, you can, this, this process works both with these transfers and with actual printed vinyl. So if you order printed sheets, and you cut them in your cutter, and you don't know how to get that on your shirt, I'll show you how to do that. It's, it's the same process. Um, although when you buy a whole sheet that's been printed, when you cut it, you can't, um, you don't flip it like you normally do. Uh, it's face up with the adhesive on the carrier. So you put it face up and you treat it like regular adhesive vinyl. You um, just cut it in forward facing orientation so like right reading it's called right reading so if you you know face up so you cut it in right reading orientation and then you weed it so it'll look like this I mean not printed but um, like this but you know your name or whatever it is this shape that you cut you weed it and then it'll look like this so once that happens you have mask you can buy it it comes with a backing um, Let's see, I have big rolls of it. I cut it into sheets and I sell the sheets. Um, or if you don't wanna buy this because you have your own, and how do you have your own? Well, if you um, use regular heat transfer vinyl, um, the kind that you flip upside down and you, uh, well, you, you put it down and you um, cut it in reverse and weed it and then flip it upside down, press it, that clear carrier you take off don't put that, don't recycle that, don't put that in the recycle bin, save it. Um, I'll show you mine. It's kind of a mess, it's just this big, it's already stuck to this one, because the ones that come with the backing, I save that too, I save everything. So this is just my, you know, mess, big piece. I will, I have a whole drawer that I just stick this in. Whenever I have big pieces, I will save the big pieces. That's not a big piece, so I'll just take my recycle bin. Plastic needs to be recycled, y'all. So these plastic bags, I put this in and I take it to Publix because they recycle plastic. Please recycle. Um, so whenever I have a big piece that I peeled away, I use that. I save it. I just I just stick it right on and I pile them up because they're good for a couple of times. So I'll use this a couple of times and then I'll toss it. Um, but if you get the kind, if you buy it with the backing on it, save the backing because you can put it on the backing. It, I mean, if you can see real close, I don't know if you can see, but it has like black lint from the shirt. It must have been a black shirt. So, you know, there's, it, it loses its stickiness after a while, but and then I've got my hair on here. You don't want to press your hair. So, you take your transfer or your weeded design and you take your clear carrier and make sure that this carrier is bigger than your transfer um, and then put it in the shape of a U. It's just like transfer tape on regular adhesive vinyl and you just set it down and then you take your squeegee, you squeegee from left to right starting in the center and then from right to left. So there you go. Now you turn it upside down just like your weeded um, adhesive vinyl and then peel that off. I haven't found any use for this. I've tried stickers, you know, I've tried using it for something. I haven't found any use for it. Um, but there you go. Now, this is the adhesive on it that actually sticks to the shirt. So then you can put this on the shirt, press it, and peel this clear carrier away, and then you can save it. Um, this is good if you're not gonna use this right away. To put this on here I'm gonna keep it because you know this is for sale in my shop um, so now if you get it it's gonna have this mask on it if you order it with mask it's already gonna be applied normally I don't apply it I just I just send it separate so that is how you mask a transfer um, and that's actually how you mask um, printed on a separate note this is actually glitter heat transfer vinyl it's thicker textured so the regular clear carrier is not going to work. When you order this from me, you do have to buy the high-tech mask. 
Um, I have it in a roll somewhere. I think, I don't know where it is. I think it's up there. Um, I have my masks and specialty things over there. And then over here is where I keep other stuff. I don't know. And then in there and up there, I have it everywhere. I have a tiny, tiny little workshop here at home, um, but it houses this big printer. And that's the bulk of what I do. I print vinyl. Um, so if uh, you have any questions, you can ask me, leave it down below. Um, but when you order the, the glitter, um, I do recommend purchasing a high-tech mask and it does come with a backing and you can't save it to so save it use it a couple times um, it does cost a little more cost me more so cost you more um, it has to be used with this glitter which also costs more so that's everything in a nutshell um, have a great day I hope everyone's staying safe uh, craft on Tanya from my vinyl cut thank you